Yeah, there's two different two different ones I can do. Like I can stop both of them like this. And then you can't hear me. So you have the vocal or then there's just the game music I can bring back in. So But oh well. That's the way it is. No one's perfect. I think I got all the Goombas around here, so let's go ahead and chase this guy still. We'll, we'll go ahead and attack him. Milo should be leveling up here in a minute. Pretty sure. Ah, oh, crap, I didn't do the double attack with him. That's alright. So this game has peace signs too. Last game had the fuzzy pickles, and this game's got the uh, peace sign when we win, win battle. So, all right, what do we got? Um, go ahead and jump on this guy. Should be dead. Nope. No, I didn't want to attack him. Is there any word on future Nintendo stuff? New Zelda, Mario. Um, um, I think I've talked about it one time where the, um, the new Zelda they have planned out, um, supposed to be next year, um, but the rumor is that Nintendo's trying to hold out and not release it on the Wii U system, but wait until they have their new system and, uh, their new system revealed. The code name is the NX right now. Um, but the rumor is that Nintendo may try to hold out and not release it for the Wii U, but wait until their new system is out, but I don't think they're going to do that. I think they are going to just go ahead and release it on the Wii U and then maybe do like what they did with Twilight Princess, where they had the GameCube version of Twilight Princess and also the Wii version, so maybe they'll do that for that, that as well. I don't know. Uh, I know, Star Fox. Yeah, Star Fox is coming out. And then, uh, you love Fuzzy Pickles. Everybody loves Fuzzy Pickles. But this part's cool here. Um, that box up there has a 1-up in it. Or not a 1-up, a star. And we're gonna probably level up pretty, pretty good here in a moment. So I'm gonna do this, do this. Oh, what? Oh, come on. There it is. And then I want to knock out as many of these guys as I can. <sighs> leveled up once. Not bad, though. Sweet. Mallow leveled up. Most of the time I can usually get probably about two um, in that. Um, so... Sometimes. But yeah, I, I love that star there. It's always sweet to get. Uh, yeah, there are boss battles. One, technically, we had with the, um, the Hammer Bro earlier there um, was technically a boss battle. Usually, the boss music is uh, different from this music here. You can kind of tell it's a little more important. Um, so. But there are boss battles. At least seven of them. Because each, each one of the stars is... Oh, nice. Each one of the stars is guarded by a, a boss, so. How did I get the double attack on that? That's rubbish. There you go. Oh, nice. Once again, again. What? I totally got the double attack on that. There we Still didn't defeat him, but oh well. And 
Mallow is going to finish off the candy. Feeling good about uh, where we are level-wise here. Not bad. What? He's not dead yet? Good defense. Now he's dead. Jeez. Nice. I still had the double attack on that. There we go. I also beat him, sweet. Alright, so it should be it for this area. Halo 5, dang, these games are sp spouting off so quick. That's, um, what, this coming week already? Is it? Come on, give me back the coin, dude. Really, I gotta go through all of this to get you? See if we can sneak up behind him and catch him. Not before I fight all these guys. And level up some more. Wow, Tuesday already, jeez. Well, I thought, uh, I was thinking we'd do Fallout in November. If I was thinking about it, I would have done one for October. For Halo. And then do Fallout for November. Meh, I don't know. Because it's better to do one where the game's not quite out yet, so if we would have done one for this month, for a game that was coming at the end, like Halo 5, more people would have been more inclined to do it, I guess, but... Nah. And then Fallout is, what, the next week? That's 11-4, right? That's a week after next? Already? Jeez, I don't... Uh, I really want to play Halo... Uh, play, well, I want to play Halo and I want to play Fallout, but... I don't know if I've got time for that and to do all this and keep up with the videos on... I mean, unless I do a playthrough on on the channel of one of those games. Eh, I don't know. I can't really do a stream of those, which sucks, but... Do it well, that is. I could do it, but it would look like rubbish. I really just want to save up all the money I can to put it toward a new computer. That's really what I'm looking for. And then I'd be able to have two, because I could have this one do some of the work to actually broadcast, whereas the other one would just be capturing all this stuff. And it actually would help uh, cut down the, the you know, the strains on uh, one computer doing all the work of capturing and or a copy of Fallout in November. Sweet. Oh, for, oh, really? Oh, geez, man. I don't have to do that. But of course, you do. Or you always do. Because you're awesome. Too awesome. 
Come on, attack me. I'm just gonna stand here, see if he attacks me. Nope, well, dropped the top to my drink. Oh well, there he is. I had it mentioned. I had mentioned it before, but wasn't sure if you mind. I mean, I never mind, dude. I always appreciate it. I just hate that you you go through all that. And I, I mean, hopefully, I, I do plan on uh, getting you reimbursed some somehow here in the future for that, of course, um, because that's just that's just too much that you do, man. Not too much. It's just overly gracious, I should say. I don't think anybody else would would do that for me really so that's just too awesome no I don't want to fight you yet dude I don't want to fight all these guys I think I remember you saying it before I just I don't remember Not a lot. that's a good chunk of, of, of money and stuff you're putting up for all all this when I mean, you've what done three well, you got me the one game, which was awesome. Uh, which I still keep trying to pick away at. Still haven't finished it at all. I've played a little bit of... Oh, nice. Level up. Sweet. Um, but you did... Um, what, you did Batman, and you did... Uh, hold on a second. Uh, oh, okay. It's just ESPN telling me about the baseball game. I know you don't. <laughs> kind of cheesy, but keep gaming. That's not cheesy. I know someone who says that all the time. HP or magic attack? I kind of want to do my magic up now. Because HP is pretty good. I think I want to do my special attack here, but... Um, but yeah, you, I mean, you did Batman, and you did... Um... Well, you did Batman, and you did Fall. You're gonna do Fallout. Um, plus, on top of that, you got me the one game, and also those tickets, dude. That uh, the Fandango stuff um, actually came in really helpful with the Star Wars tickets, because I bought 11 tickets, and that took a good chunk out. So I'm kind of glad we held on to those as long as we did, because uh, that took a big chunk out of those 11 tickets that I bought. So that is awesome. Again, thank you. I was I was there, kind of rushing to the computer, uh, making sure I got everything straight and how many tickets and stuff. And I'm sitting there and I'm on the site, and it says Fandango or whatever. And I'm like, wait a second, I've got I've got something about that. And I ran back to my wallet. I mean, I was in I was out of breath because I was running around so much trying to figure it out. Because she's like, people are buying tickets now, go. And it was before they actually said that tickle tickets are available. At the end of the trailer, it says that. Um, so she said one of her friends you know, has the tickets already, you should go and check, because I had the sites up all day, all of the, the Star Wars sites I follow, and the tickets, and the stuff where I was going to buy them, had them up all day, refreshing it, make sure I kind of stayed on top of it all, ran back to the computer, saw it was available to do it, ran back to the wallet, and luckily I remembered that those were there, and I got a big chunk, so, oh sweet, lucky, that's a new, uh, that's what it was for. So we just got one of the little uh, lucky things that popped out. So here what we can do. If we get the lucky things, we can double the experience points with this challenge. Um, I can either do it, and if I win, then it doubles. Or if I lose, we get no experience. Or I can just say no. So let's go ahead and just do it. So there's Yoshi. He was in the middle. What? He was so in the middle. I think it's just a toss-up. I think it just randomly chooses. Like, I was watching the egg closely, and it was so not the one on the left. But anyways, I think all the baddies are done. Uh, those guys are going to pop out every time. So let's go ahead and just take on this guy here. We've got to go up behind him. Turn around, dude. There he is. 
There he is. Cars are much faster than your feet. At this rate, it'll take you a hundred more years to catch me. And off he goes. And then I go up behind him again. I so had him from behind that time. Oh, what? Come on. There we go. I'm much faster than your feet. At this rate, it'll take you 50 more years to catch me. No, not really, dude. Oh, come on. Got him. Oh, what? I totally got him there. Shoot. Not running fast enough. Oh, wait, here we go. Thought he turned around. You got me fair and square. I'll give you back your coin. Did you really believe me? I was lying. So here's a boss battle in a sense. Why does it say deleted link? That's weird. You just said lol, but it was thinking it was a link, but it still showed still showed up there. But in the Twitch chat it said deleted link. I don't know. So here's the music. Um, this is kind of like the boss battle music in a sense, so. We're gonna go all out on this guy. We're gonna fire orb this guy here. Ah, one wasn't that bad. 104. Boom! Do thunderbolt on him. Don't I rotate the pad? I think. No, I really didn't do much. Dark stealth. What? Is, I don't remember saying that before. That's weird. Uh, let's go ahead and do fire orb, orb again. Nice. And thunderbolt. Sixteen. He's got bombs, too. Weird mushroom. Um... 60. His bombs are... crazy powerful, too. 47. I just gotta attack now. See, Milo's attack is so bad on this guy. 36. Not even worth it, really. No bomb. No bomb. Crap. Well, yeah, see, that's not too bad, but... Yeah, um, I've got... Um, because we were able to get tickets for Thursday afternoon or evening, um, my wife will be able to go, because if not, we were going to go at midnight, and um, she wouldn't be able to stay up that late, plus with being pregnant. I mean, at that point, she'll be eight months pregnant. Um, so it still may be... still may be tough for her to go, but... She would have to work the next morning, and going at midnight, uh, with with the movie and traffic and everything, we probably wouldn't get home till like 3.30, because um, we would we live an hour away from where we're seeing the, the movie. So we got the, the 8 o'clock showing on Thursday before, um, so that way she'd be able to go, plus uh, my best friend and his wife are, are going to be in town up from New York, um, and then I've got my parents are going to go. And then uh, two other friends of ours, and then uh, my cousin and his two daughters. So I pretty much just got in touch with all of them, and I'm like, I'll just buy them all at once so we make sure we get them so you guys don't have to go through it all. And wanted to get two more for my sister and her boyfriend, which I didn't know at the time they wanted to go, because um, I mean, neither of them are really Star Wars fans. I don't think he actually hasn't seen many of the movies or any of them. Um... But, uh, I tried to get back on and try to get them two tickets, but at that time, just, I couldn't do it. Oh, he's down. I think I can beat him with just myself here. Pretty sure he's almost dead. Yeah, there we go. Give me back my coin, or I'll belt ya. Were they regular price or extra? Um, they were regular, um, what were they, ten? Ten bucks or whatever? I think that they, that's what they worked out to, and then because you bought them online, they have like a convenience fee. So I ended up paying an extra like fifteen dollars for a convenience fee. Um, but yeah, they were regular, 
you know, non-matinee price, of course, so the regular, whatever they are, $10 or $9.75, um, plus a little extra fee there, but, but I'm, I didn't buy them for everybody, they're gonna be paying me back for them, <laughs> luckily. <laughs> yeah, Alright, so he said, give me back my coin or I'll belt you, there we go, we got the coin back. I'm gonna pay you back in spades, kid. Smash. Go on. Take back your grubby old coin. Adios, amigos. There we go. Alright. We got it back. And we got a flower tab and EXP. Now, I don't know if... Because Milo died, does he get the EXP? I don't remember if your characters get EXP on this game if you die. Don't remember. Uh, the cargo guy left a wallet. Found a wallet. I'm going back to the shop at Mushroom Kingdom. Are you coming? And there's a little teleport so we don't have to go through all of the level again. Or go backwards through the whole level. So we can just go right back to where we need to be. And I'm gonna skip over all these guys for now. We're just gonna go back to the shop. 